uh, welcome again sa ating tutorial so we have problem use Castellanos theorem to find the deflection at point B of the simple beam in the figure shown so A is equal to 29 times 10 to the power of 6 space I and I is equal to 2250 inches to the fourth so we have simple beam subjected to triangular loadings now for the required deflection so we have elastic curve then we have yb or the required deflection at point b so to find yb using this formula or equation yb is equal to integral of m times the partial derivative of m with respect to p times dx over ei so yung limit natin 0 to l so solution now to find the required deflection at point b kailangan natin mag apply ng imaginary p load at point b so we have p we have a y e x then c y now for the resultant of triangular loadings along a b so we have one half times three times twenty is equal to thirty kips at a distance of forty over three feet from point a then we have resultant of triangular loadings along BC so 1 half times 3 times 10 is equal to 15 kips at a distance of 70 over 3 feet from point A ok now solve for reactions so summation of forces along X is equal to 0 so by inspection ex is equal to 0 now for the cy no summation of moment at point a is equal to 0 considering counterclockwise is positive so we have cy times 30 minus p times 20 minus 30 times 40 over 3 minus 15 times 70 over 3 is equal to 0 so cy is equal to 25 plus 2, 2p over 3 uh, this is upward now for the ay using summation of forces along y is equal to 0 so considering upward is positive so ay plus 25 plus 2, 2p over 3 minus p minus 15 minus 30 is equal to 0 so ay is equal to 20 plus p over 3 so this is upward ok now for the span AB so origin natin at A so kailangan natin i-cut yung segment AB or span AB at a distance X from point A so we have point O then reaction AY is equal to 20 plus P over 3 then the internal moment at point O then the intensity y now for the resultant of 3x over 20 so we have 1 half times 3x over 20 times x is equal to 3x squared over 40 at a distance x over 3 from point o now for the m summation of moment at point o is equal to 0 considering counterclockwise is positive so we have m minus 20 plus p over 3 times x plus 3x squared over 40 
times x over 3 is equal to 0. Now to simplify, so m minus 20 times x minus p over 3 times x plus x raised to 3 over 40 is equal to 0. So m is equal to 20x plus xp over 3 minus x raised to 3 over 40. Now for the for the partial derivative of m with respect to p is equal to x over 3. Okay. Now for the span bc, kailangan natin ikat yung bc, no? So yung origin natin at c. So we have uh, segment along BC no? at a distance X from point C so we have reaction 25 plus 2P over 3 so you, we have point D then the moment or internal moment at point D then we have intensity Z no? now solve for Z so Z over X is equal to 3 over 10. So, Z is equal to 3X over 10. Okay. Now, for the resultant of 3X over 10. So, 1 half times 3X over 10 times X is equal to 3X squared over, over 20. At a distance X over, over 3 at uh, from point D. Now, for the M, summation of moment at point D is equal to 0. So, considering counterclockwise, positive. So, negative M plus 25 plus 2P over 3. Yun ang reaction natin. Times X. So, minus 3X squared over 20 times X over 3 is equal to 0. So, simplify, no? So, negative M plus 25X plus 2XP over 3 minus X raised to 3 over 20 is equal to 0. So, M is equal to 25X plus 2XP over 3 minus X raised to 3 over 20. Now, for the partial derivative of M with respect to P is equal to 2X over 3. Okay. Now, for the summary. So, we have span, origin, limits, M. Then, the partial derivative of M with respect to P. Now, for the span AB. So, origin natin at A. So, yung limit 0 to 20 feet. So, we have M 20X minus XP over 3 minus X raised to 3 over 40. Then, for the BC, origin natin sa C. Then, na limit 0 to 10, 10 feet. So, yung M 25X plus 2XP over 3 minus x raised to raised to 3 over 20 now for for the partial derivative of m with respect to p so for the span a b so we have x over 3 then for the span b c so we have two third of x so use since the p is an imaginary no so, it will be 0. So, yb is equal to integral of m times the partial derivative of m with respect to p times dx over ei. So, yung limit 0 to l. Now, so, yung ei, ilabas natin. Oh. So, ei yb is equal to 
for the span AB. So, yung limit, 0 to 20. So, yung M, 20x time, uh, 20x minus x raised to 3 over 40. Then, yung partial derivative, so x over 3 times dx. Plus, for the segment or for the span BC, so yung limit natin, 0 to 10. Then, for the M, 25x minus x raised to 3 over 20 times 2x over 3 dx okay now using calculator so for the span ab so we have 112,000 over 9 plus for the span bc so we have 44,000 over 9 then pag in combine mo yan so, we have 52,000 over 3 keeps uh, feet raised to 3. So, we have YB is equal to 52,000 times 12 raised to 3 times 1,000. So, conversion ito into inches or inch over 3. Then, over EI or 29 times 10 to the power of 6 times 2,250. So, yung YB natin is equal to point, uh, 0.459 inch. So, this is downward. Okay.